Hello everyone. Let's solve this problem quickly. N minus 1 equal to square root of 2 over square root of 5 into N plus 1. And we are looking for the value of N. The first thing we are going to do is um, to multiply everything by root 5. So we have root 5 multiplying n minus 1 then it will be equal to it's going to clear itself from here so we have from um, root 2 into bracket n plus 1 okay and then from here since we are looking for n i will have to multiply everything i mean i will have to open this bracket so that n can come out so 5 root 5 times n is um root 5 n okay let me put this here and then root 5 times minus 1 that will give us minus root 5 then this is equal to root 2 times n then plus root 2 times 1 is the same root 2 okay now the terms that contain n i have to bring them together so I will have root 5 times n, then minus root 2 times n equal to, I'll pick root 2 first, then plus root um, 5. Now, the next thing I'm going to do is to factor out um, n since it's common to this 2. So if n comes out, I will have root 5 minus root 2. Then this is equal to root 2 plus root 5, right? Now, since I'm looking for the value of n, I have to divide both sides by root 5 minus root 2. So I'll divide this by um, root 5 minus root 2. Now, remember that this can cancel this, and then I'll have n to be equal to root 2 plus root 5 all over root 5 minus um, root 2 and now remember that we can also find the conjugate of this then we rationalize this so the conjugate of this is root 5 plus root 2 so we'll multiply everything by the conjugate so when i do that n will be equal to root 2 plus root 5 all over root 5 minus root 2 multiply by the conjugate now which will be root 5 plus root 2 all over um, we shall have um, root 5 um, minus root okay the conjugate is still positive so we have positive root 2 now how do i multiply this this means that our n is equal to root 2 plus root 5 squared. I will square this, then all over. I'm going to multiply the denominator now. I will have 5 multiplied by 5. That will give us 5. Sorry, root 5 multiplied by root 5 will give us 5. Because square root of 25 is 5. Then root 5 multiply by this that will give us plus root 10 and then minus root 2 multiply by root 5 will give us minus root 10 and then root 2 times root 2 that will give us minus 2 because of this negative then from here this and this will eliminate each other so if i proceed i'll have n to be equal to root 2 plus root 5 squared all over 5 minus 2 we have 5 minus 2 then if i take a step further i will have n to be equal to root 2 plus root 5 all squared all over 3 remember the reason for this is to have a number which is not um, a non-rational number as the denominator so thank you for watching 
subscribe to my youtube channel for more videos like this